Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel, or if this is your first time to my channel. Hi, my name is Sarah. I make a lot of special effects tutorials, mostly around Halloween time, some beauty type videos, and a little bit of DIY in between. For today's video, I'm going to be going over all of my like must-haves and wanting to try is basically my wish list for the Sephora VIB sale. So between everything I'm mentioning, nothing is in any particular order. I'm just reading it off of the site to how I clicked it. So let's get started. Alright, so for these kind of sales, I usually tend to go for more like travel size items because I want to test out new items, but I don't want to pay for like the full size size and with the discount that's going to be applied it's basically like paying for a travel size item without actually having the travel size pricing which we all know that travel size stuff is a little bit more expensive than it needs to be. I either go for like travel size stuff or maybe for gift sets because gift sets tend to have a lot of stuff in them that's already at a very discounted price and then on top of the applied discount you're just gonna get a lot for your money's worth and I definitely always want to try new things out. So the VIB Rouge is from August 24th which by the time this video goes up that'll be long gone however it is until September 3rd and you get 20% off if you use the code YESRUGE. The Sephora VIB sale specifically is August 30th to September 3rd that is going to be 15% off when you use the code YESRUGE. VIB and then the Sephora Beauty Insider is from August 30th to September 3rd again but you get 10% off if you use the code YESINSIDER. If you're gonna spend money anyways might as well save some anyways. I also have to know that you can use a site called Ebates for this as well. I do use it quite a bit when I'm doing online shopping and it's basically just ebates.ca I believe or ebates.com. Two different sites but they're the exact same kind of concept. You go through it to Sephora and you can actually get cash back on any of your purchases that you make. I don't know what percentage it is because it changes from time to time, but just another little tidbit of information. I'll leave that in the down bar below as well. The first thing I want to mention is Ole Henriksen's, I think that's how you say the name, Banana Brightening Eye Cream. So this is going to have a cream consistency, obviously, because it's literally just a cream but it also has the banana aspect to it and if any of you have ever used a banana powder it definitely helps out with brightening your under eyes but this is going to be in a cream form and eye cream is actually very very important something i don't use as often as i should i will definitely be picking one of these guys up so adding your eye cream onto obviously your eyes you can add it onto the, like your lid and also underneath your eye both are going to be really good for you. It's not going to have any negative side effects or aspects to it. The second one is already something that I've purchased already, so I might not even have to get the travel size because I got like the travel size first time. And the only downside to this is that I find, oh, I haven't even mentioned what the product is. <laughs> it is the Milk Makeup Kush Mascara. The only downside I find to this is that when I put the applicator in, a little bit of product always goes around the rim, which happens normally in mascara but then when you push it further in it comes just right out and then I always have to wipe it up with makeup wipe. So I don't know if that happens to anybody else. If it does, does anybody have a fix for it? Because like it kind of wastes product every single time I use it but I actually love the mascara. It just adds length and volume and everything good you want out of a mascara. It's got it. The next one is actually a tool that I want to pick up and it is the Herbivore Jade Facial Roller. Now I've seen this mentioned by Jay Kissa so obviously if it's mentioned by Jay Kissa I pretty much have to pick it up. <laughs> But what I wanted to say about this product specifically is that um, you can put it into the freezer or the fridge. Jade is naturally going to be more cooling on the skin. They do have other ones, like they have a rose gold one, I think, that's actually made out of rose stone. Gonna have the same kind of effect to it, only jades, I think, are more on the cooling side. But you can definitely put it into the fridge if you want the cooling effect. It just tends to, like, calm the skin and, like, deep puff you. And it also helps if you add any, like, oils to your skin. Then you can use the jade roller and it won't, like catch or skip on your skin and it really helps to like really sink them into your skin. How many times can I say skin in this video? The next one is the Dr. Jart uh, Shake and Shake and Shot to Go set. Now I think in my last year's video or even maybe this year's video for the last Sephora VIB sale I mentioned the shot glasses that they have which are essentially like you shake them and then you put them onto your face as a shot. And then you just do different things depending on which one you use. But all I've heard is good things about these shot glasses. And seeing as how it is a set worth 60 bucks and you're actually paying 45 for it, you definitely get a good discount. Plus, again, applying the discount, you're getting a further discount. Now, again, taking this back to Jay Kissa, she mentioned something on her channel. I think it was her skincare routine video or maybe it was just like her favorite Tatcha products. I don't know, but Tatcha products tend to be really expensive no matter what kind of product you're actually getting. But the one that I was most interested in was either the Tatcha Essence, which... My god, it is so expensive. It's $114, which your girl ain't got that kind of money. So the other one I was thinking about is the Tatcha, the Rice Polishing Foaming and Limb Powder. So it's essentially going to be almost like an exfoliator, but it is an exfoliator, but you add water, like you introduce water to it a little bit in your hand, you mix it together, and then you add it as an exfoliator. It's going to help out with your pores, any dullness, and like uneven texture in your skin, and definitely some fine lines and wrinkles. Because it is made from Japanese rice bran, 
Everybody knows that Japanese are like notorious for their skincare routines. I don't even know what it is about them, but that is why. Plus maybe genetics a little bit. Anyone who is Japanese, they, it's like, they don't age until they just like age in one day. And I don't know what it is, but I'm all about that. So anything with like a Japanese skincare routine, I'm totally down for trying. The next one is another kind of tool type thing. There's the Tarte Mermaid Treasure Custom Magic. I can't even say it. The Tarte Mermaid Treasures Custom Magnet Magnet The Tarte Mermaid Treasures Custom Magnetic Palette Be a Mermaid and Make Waves Collection Essentially this is just a Z palette which I already have far too many of and I'll admit that but this one's so cute so cute it's going to have that material on it i assume that's the material and it's not just sequins you can like push up or down it's like different colors whichever way you push it it is 22 dollars, which isn't actually that much more expensive than any other z palette and i've read the reviews on it and all of them say that it's a lot bigger than they actually thought it would initially be which is another plus in my opinion and the last product it's not actually a product for me but you know, if you have any men in your life, your dad, your boyfriend, your husband, anything like that, why not pick them up a gift during the sale? I mean, I seriously doubt they're shopping all that much on Sephora. No shade if you are. If you are, that's totally cool. The Clinique face soap with a dish. It literally just comes with a dish and it has a face soap in it. And it's basically like a cleanser because I don't know what it is about men. They don't like washing their face. And they definitely don't like going through all the steps that maybe I would go through to cleanse my face. Like, I, I go through so many freaking steps to even just get the face that I have right now. It's, it's really not that great anyways. Men just are really, really lazy naturally. No offense, that's not a generalization completely. Some men out there are really not lazy, but just what I've experienced. They do become quite a bit lazier with any routines or anything that they have to do that involves their skin or just cleaning in general. So this is an oil control formula that thoroughly cleanses normal to oily skin while removing excess shine. Oh yeah, one more item I actually want to add. I've had this pretty much every video I think I've made when it comes to the Sephora VIB sales, but I will always repurchase this because, oh my god, it is so amazing. I heard about this from Mikey, which is Glam and Gore here on YouTube, and ever since then I have used this actively, like literally every single day, like non-stop. It is the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. So she used this in her video last year. It was a sponsored video from Clinique. She used it to take off her Halloween makeup and let me just tell you, let me tell you, this works wonders. Whether you're taking off mascara, taking off any actually intense eye makeup, any brows, anything at all, even face paint this works really well for, like body painting. This is amazing. I've already used up so much of this and I bought myself a new one because I never want to go a day without this, but... <laughs> But that is it for today's video and I do hope you guys enjoyed and I do hope you guys maybe have an idea of what you want to get if you want to get anything from this sale. Because I definitely recommend if you have been wanting to get anything from Sephora that you do take advantage of all these sales that are going on. Because why not? You're saving money and you're getting what you want. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!